This is WNAC-TV, Boston. This is the Emmy Award-winning Newsroom 7 with John Henning and Mary Richardson. Bob Gamir has sports and meteorologist Harvey Leonard the weather. Good evening. Here's what's happening this Friday night, February 16th. This is Election 80, a special edition of Newsroom 7 with political editor Bill Selby and Brad Holbrook. Sports with John Dennis and weather with meteorologist Shane Holland. Now, here is Bill Selby. Good afternoon, everybody. It is November 3rd, Election Eve. And I now, Newsroom 7, the 11 o'clock update with Brad Holbrook and Lynn Vaughn, meteorologist Shane Hollett, and sports with Bob Gamere. Direct from our Newsroom 7 studios in Government Center in Boston, here is Brad Holbrook. Good evening. Tonight's top story... Bill Selby, Larry Sales... Weather with Mark Nichols. This is News 7. Good afternoon. Our top story... This is New England's leading news team, Tom Ellis and Robin Young, with News 7. Good evening, everybody. Topping News 7 tonight... It's And Robin Young with News 7. Good evening, everybody. Rob this is News 7 Weekend with Bill O'Reilly and Susan Burke. WNEB TV, Channel 7, Boston. The station that received the Emmy for New England's outstanding newscast. Now, R.D. Solved. Camilla Carr and Tom Chisholm together bringing today's news home to you. This is the New England News. Good afternoon. Topping the New England News this Friday. WNEV-TV, Channel 7, Boston. The station that has once again received the Emmy for New England's outstanding newscast. And now, Tom Ellis, Dion Willis, Harvey Leonard, and John Dennis, together bringing the day's news home to you. This is the New England News. Good evening, everyone. WNEB-TV, Channel 7, Boston. The station that received the Emmy for New England's outstanding newscast. Now, Lester Strong, Paul Azan, Todd Gross, and Gary Gillis, together bringing tonight's news home to you. This is the New England News. And good evening. Topping the New England News, a major shock tonight for Brockton's marvelous Marvin Hagler. Now, live from Boston and all around New England, this is the New England News. I don't have any regrets for anything that I did. I think the actions that I took were in the long-term interests of the country, and I'm not going to change my mind, and I'm not going to be apologetic about it. The Iran-Contra hearings heat up as Admiral John Poindexter defends the actions he authorized and the secrets he kept. Good evening. Tonight on the New England News. Now, live from Boston and all around New England, this is the New England News. Good evening. Topping the New England News, Governor Dukakis leads a showdown over Seabrook. Live from Boston and all around New England, this is the New England News, Night Beat. Good evening on the Night Beat tonight. Channel 7, WNEV, Boston. Now, with your first evening news, Dave Wright, Diana Williams, and the Channel 7 News team. This is the New England News, live at 5. Well, good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to Live at Five. Your first evening news continues with Dave Wright, Diana Williams, 
and the Channel 7 News team. This is the New England News, live at 5. Hello again, everyone. It's 5.30, and this is the second half hour of Live at 5. Channel 7, WNEV-TV, Boston. Now, from Boston and all around New England, this is the New England News Nightly. Topping Nightly tonight, the town of Gardner searches for answers in the deaths of three local residents. Now, your first evening news. From WNEV in Boston, this is News 7 New England. WNEV TV Boston. This is News 7 New England. WNEV TV Boston. This is News 7, New England. And topping News 7 tonight. WNEV-TV, Boston. This is News 7, New England. WHDH-TV, Boston. This is News 7, New England. Good evening, topping News 7 at 6. Drug abuse on the T. From WHDH-TV, Boston, News 7 at noon. The storm that socked the Bay State coastline is finally over. From WHDH-TV, Boston, this is News 7 at 5.30. First weather, first sports, now on News 7. Good evening, topping News 7 tonight. From WHDH-TV, Boston, this is News 7 at 11. Calm after the storm in Charlestown, but residents and city leaders still struggle for answers. Live from WHDH TV Boston, this is 7 News at 11. Live from WHDH TV Boston. Three, ten, five, two, on the air. Seven News at 5. Show and tell at the Simpson trial. Detective Mark Furman testifies about what he found the morning after the murder. We're live in L.A. Please. Live from WHDH-TV Boston. This is 7 News at 11. Remembering a high school athlete who died playing the game he loved. Broadcasting live from Channel 7, the news station. This is 7 News, first at 4. He's accused of killing his young neighbor as she slept in her bed. Now this Massachusetts man faces a grieving family in court. A man feeling. And so does Steve. Yeah, but he might want to pursue it. Pursue it anyway. New England's News Channel Station. 7 in Boston. Jim Carrigan and John Marler bring you 7 News at 11. A major turning point tonight in the Republican race for president. Live from WHDHTV Boston, this is 7 News at 4 on the news station. Good afternoon, everyone. It is here. The holiday shopping season has officially arrived. You are watching the news station. This is 7 News at 4 with Lester Strong, Kathy Marshall, and Harvey Leonard with weather. Live from 
WHDH-TV Boston. This is 7 News at 6 on the news station. Strong storm struck the Bay State. And heavy rains causing some flooding in some areas. Parts of Massachusetts remain under a thunderstorm watch until 7 p.m. tonight. Good evening, everyone. Harvey Leonard's been tracking these storms, which have brought a bit of hail in some spots. We get the latest now from the 7 Weather Center. Har this is 7 News with Kim Kerrigan, Randy Price, Harvey Leonard with weather, and Gene Levanti with sports on the news station. A well-known Kennedy will speak at next month's Democratic National Convention. Live from WHDH-TV Boston, this is 7 News at 11 on the news station. Good evening again. Kate's not feeling well tonight. I'm Craig Stevens. It was another magic you are watching the news station. This is 7 News at 11 with Kim Kerrigan, John Marler, Harvey Leonard, and Gene Levanti with sports. This is 7 News with Christy Kim, Jonathan Hall, and Todd Gross with weather on the news station. Welcome back. Some local sailing enthusiasts are teaming up to give... Live from WHDH-TV Boston, this is 7 News at 11 on the news station. Rain, but now take a look at this live. You are watching 7 News with Krista Del Camp and Jonathan Hall and meteorologist Pete Bouchard with weather on the news station. Actress. Live from Boston, this is 7 News first at 4 on the news station. We began with breaking news out of Colorado. Two schools there have now been a you are watching 7 News with Chris May and Francis Rivera and Chief Meteorologist Pete Bouchard with weather on the news station. In time to check news across America today, five Oklahoma City... Live from Boston, this is 7 News at 5 on the news station. And good evening, America's closest ally has a new proposal aimed Live from Boston, this is 7 News at 5 on the news station. I've been fighting this chronic disease. You're watching 7 News with Randy Price and Katerina Bandini. Chief Meteorologist Todd Gross with weather and Gene Levanti with sports on the news station. A stalker scare for singer Lenny Kravitz, a fan. Seven News with Randy Price and Katerina Bandini, Chief Meteorologist Pete Bouchard with weather, and Joe Amorosino with sports on the news station. Stuck on you, a bear. F Live from Boston. This is Seven News at five thirty on the news station. Missing. And 76 begins with a weather alert. Good evening. Some uh, strong weather moving through Worcester County right now. It is heading east. Hello. Live from Boston, this is 7 News at 6 on the news station. I do know enough. You are 7 News with Randy Price and Katerina Bandini. Chief Meteorologist Don Gross with weather and Joe Amorosino with sports on the news station. Drunk and disorderly, a neighbor's camera catches rowdy crowd. Live from Boston, this is 7 News at 11 on the news station. Remember 
this soaking scene on Sunday. We'll get ready for more wet and windy weather. Good evening, everyone. A wintry mix has already started in western Massachusetts. What you are watching 7 News with Randy Price and Katerina Bandini, Chief Meteorologist Todd Gross with weather, and Joe Amorosino with sports on the news station. Live from Boston. This is 7 News at noon. And we begin with breaking news and live from Boston. This is 7 News at 4.30 on the news station. We begin with breaking live from Boston. This is 7 News at 5 on the news station. It drugs and live from Boston. This is 7 News at 5.30 on the news station. A teen buys a cell phone she says included pornographic pictures of this guy giving her... This is 7 News Today in New England. Friends and family gather in Seekong to remember a teenager killed in a tragic accident on the highway. Seven News at Noon. Need details emerging. For today, a North Attleboro swim coach facing criminal charges for possession of child pornography. Thanks for joining us this afternoon. Federal officials say they tracked down the coach online. A man hit and killed on 495 in Westford. Police say he pulled over his car to the side of the highway, and when he got out, he was hit by a tractor trailer. Hi. This is 7 News at 5. We begin at 5 with a 7 News weather alert. The rain has been coming down fast and furious. This is 7 News at 5.30. And we begin with breaking news at 5.30. Two more deaths here in Boston have been linked to the H1N1 virus. Common It's another hot one here in Boston. Families from across town seeking relief in the fountain at the Frog Pond. Boston Common was just one of the hot spots for people trying to stay cool today. Oh, we... Massachusetts is going... This is 7 News at 11. And we begin at 11 with breaking news. Wind and rain gaining strength along the Florida coast as Tropical Storm Claudette heads for land. We have developing news here this morning. Health care at MGH. Well, good morning, everybody. We're so glad you could join us on this Thursday morning. I love Thursdays. I'm Kana Whitworth. And I'm Krista Del Kim. This is 7 News. Tracking breaking news here this noon time. Just moments ago, prosecutors here in Boston announcing the indictment of former Patriot Aaron Hernandez. On 7 News at noon. A big day of breaking news. More murder charges. This is 7 News at 4. We begin at 4 with breaking news. Aaron Hernandez now facing two new counts of first-degree murder. Breaking news. Aaron Hernandez charged with murder again. 7 News at 5 starts now. And we continue to follow breaking news at 5. Breaking news in the Aaron Hernandez case. 7 News at 5.30 starts now. Breaking news unfolding in the Aaron Hernandez case. The former New England Patriots tight end who is in custody on one murder charge. Breaking news in the case against Aaron Hernandez. 7 News at 6 starts now. We begin with breaking news in the Aaron Hernandez case. The former Patriots star indicted today on two charges of first-degree murder. 
developing tonight. The West Coast is on burn notice. 7 News at 11 starts now. First at 11 tonight in jail and awaiting trial for one murder. Aaron Hernandez is now connected to two more. Now at 6, local leaders demanding action after the Merrimack Valley gas disaster. This is 7 News Today in New England. Good morning, everybody. It is 6 o'clock on a soggy Tuesday. What's new, right? Now at 5, a tragic crash. A 7 News at 5 starts now. First at 5, a teenager facing troubling charges in connection to that crash. Now at 6, inspections underway. 7 News at 6 starts now. First at 6, a developing story. Now at 6.30, breaking news. 7 News at 6.30 starts now. And breaking news, first here at 6.30, a police rushing to a courthouse in Boston to help an EMT that was stabbed in a... Right now at 9, a Boston EMT stabbed in the back of an ambulance. 7 News at 9 starts now. Tonight at 9, an EMT stabbed. Now at 10, ambushed in an ambulance. 7 News at 10 starts now. Tonight at 10, transport trouble in Boston. Channel 7. No one, two, one.